Good evening. Welcome to the boutique. Ooh. Oh my. I don't even know what to wear. Hey y'all, come on in. Welcome to the boutique. Look, I need a haircut, some kind of something. So forgive me. But y'all come on in while I figure out what earrings I should wear. Cause I don't know. I'm not gonna be long tonight. Um because we had some work done in the house and they just finished doing the work. And um, I need to go straighten up my house because it's going to drive me crazy. I'm already like a little unsettled right now, but we're going to keep on keeping on, right? So um, I'm going to do a couple of trivia questions. I'm not going to do too many simply because um, I need to go get my house in order. So anyway, welcome to the boutique, y'all. What's going on? My name is Tisha Stargle, and I am coming to you from the Stargazer Boutique. I am a star consultant with Paparazzi Accessories. I am going to be showing you some $5 fabulousness tonight. Everything that you will see this evening is $5, all lead and nickel-free jewelry. Okay, look, I'm hot. I had to take my shoes off. Y'all mind? don't mind me. I had to get comfortable. Everything you see is going to be lead and nickel-free. Um, all of the jewelry, like I said, is $5 plus tax, shipping, and handling. Shipping and handling is a $5 rate unless you spend $75 or more, and then it is free. All right. So with that being said, welcome to the boutique. Welcome to Trivia Night. And let us get started. Come on in. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Y'all, don't be scared. Come on in. And you know what? It just dawned on me. I don't think I did my drawing from last week's Trivia Night. Oh, y'all need to hold me accountable for that. Come on now, y'all got to hold me accountable. All right, so tonight's going to be a really brief trivia night, like I said. So I'm going to get, oh my, oh, I feel so out of sorts. Y'all, I got stuff all over my house. Please forgive me. We finally were brave enough to have somebody come in and finish working on our floors. So forgive me, forgive me, forgive me. So I've got some goody, goody, goody. Really? You should have lots of entries? Are you serious right now? Hi, Doc. Aren't you supposed to be straightening up? Aren't you supposed to be cleaning? Doing something? Like doing something? What you doing? What's going on? Anywho. So I'm only going to show a few, um, do a few trivia questions this evening. So y'all bear with me. But first up is this gorgeous gold long. Mm -mm -mm. See, you're a distraction. <laughs> Behave. Oh, I'm glistening. Y'all, I'm glistening. It is hot. It's hot in here. Doc, what's the heat on? I'm sweating. I'm perspiring. All right. Anywho. So this first piece is a long gold tone necklace. It has an orange beading. And then it drops down into a tassel. For some reason, this reminds I know Christmas is over, but this reminds me of a Christmas ornament. And then the way that that tassel drops down from that, absolutely adorable. This is item number 643. So if you are new to the boutique, or if you are new, if you are new to the boutique or new to paparazzi, all of our necklaces come with complimentary earrings, matching earrings. Now, let me tell you, the earrings tend to be a little bit modest, so that's fine. Hey, Sherry. Hey, Keisha. Happy Friday. The earrings tend to be a little bit modest, so for $5, you can upgrade the earrings. It's all good, right? 
Or if you like your earrings to be a little bit modest and you really like to coordinate, then you go with the ones that came. But, so this is what we have here, this gold piece. How do you claim it? You claim it by saying star and the item number. So this is 643. So star 643 for this gorgeous piece that has been sitting in the boutique. I have a backlog of inventory that I've got to get out to you all. 643 for that one. So you claim it star 643, right? And if you have not gotten your pearls for the 20th, my homepage on my face, on my website, my homepage has nothing but pearls. So go take a look at that. You'll see the link at the bottom of, um, of the video. All right, next up, this gorgeous silver link chain. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't think I ordered enough of these, but you know, that tends to be the way the cookie crumbles. I don't know what happened. This is item number 637. 637, here are the matching earrings. Now these earrings are cute, right? If you like something a little more understated or you, or you just upgrade your earrings to some nice little hoops, right? Because the way this necklace is working, I'm sorry, but I gotta add some hoops to it. That's just me. I'm a hoop girl. So these hoops are item number 656. So looking at this set right here would be a $10 set with the hoops. Now this is just a recommendation. I'm just showing you how you can pair up your stuff, right? I'm showing you how you can pair it up. Ooh, okay. Ooh, ooh wee. You know, stuff don't never cooperate when company is around. I'm trying to tell you. So you can pair those hoops up with that. If that's not your thing, then you do something else. Hey, Lala, what's going on? What is going on, girl? I'm popping. I'm hot. I'm sweating. This is item number 637 for the necklace. And then the earrings is item number 656. The way you see this is a $10 set. You can do that. You know why you can do that? Because that's your business and you can do that. This, These are the hoops. And y'all listen, I struggled with what earrings I was going to put on tonight. Like real talk. I really did. I didn't know. And I might do, you know, hey, I might do a wardrobe change just because. So these hoops right here. So I will be rocking these hoops. You will see those again. 656. Six. 656 for those. And 637 for the necklace. Right? So, time to whip out some trivia. If you are not a paparazzi consultant, I ask that you please share my video. Share it to your page. You share my video. You get entered into a drawing to receive five free pieces of jewelry. So, it is worth it to share my video. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. All right, here's the first trivia question. The study of plants is known as what? The study of plants is known as what? If you get the first person that I see that gets it right, gets credit for having it. Only the first person. And we got some folks on here that, you know, David, really? All right, y'all. I don't want people thinking that I got a ringer on the line. I don't want people thinking I got a ringer, sir. Like, oh, look. Oh, I need a haircut. Oh, my goodness. Excuse me. All right. Let's get back to some jewelry. Next up, this beautiful piece just came in. She is a bracelet. Look at that bling. She would be really cute stacked. What do I mean by stacked? I mean wearing more than one to give it a thicker look. Right here. Look at that. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Yes, baby. She is pretty, pretty. Right here. This is item number 664. 664. Right here. I'm going to get you on camera selling. You're going to do the men's line. We're going to do that. This We're going to practice. 664. You want you want to attention so much. Do I not give you enough attention? Oh, my gosh. Y'all, you just show out in front of company. Y'all, don't laugh at him because all that does is fuel him. Please don't laugh at him. Next up, can never have too many pearls. Listen, this is almost like a charm bracelet. Look at this. 
Look at absolutely, this would be really cute. Y'all know I had that Lucretia on earlier this week. This would be really cute with our zebra, with our Z necklace, Lucretia, and then stack her. This would also be a cute anklet because anytime, anytime the, uh, they look like a charm bracelet, I think they make really cute anklets because that would hang on your ankles really nice. This is item number 660. 660. Got you, cuz. 660 for this one. Right here. But yes, this would be... I need to... I don't have Lucretia up here with me anymore. I should have had her on. So. So, yes. What are y'all's plans for the weekend? Who has plans for the weekend? All right, next up, woo-wee, listen, listen, this is item number 639, they're the matching earrings, let's see, this one has a little more, um, you know, it's Friday night, I don't know, I don't know where she is, I'm not sure, but you know, stuff happens, people, I think she is also, I think she might be prepping to go out of town, she's getting ready to go out of the country. So lucky her. She's getting ready to travel back home. This is item number six, 639. Look at this. This hammered necklace. Ooh, y'all, listen. The way it lays along the collar is absolutely nothing but fabulousness. Ooh, and I got to sneeze. Eek! Excuse me. Mm. Ooh, please excuse me. Right? So... This piece right here, item 639, yes, it is $5. It is only $5. And I always put that challenge out. If you see a piece that, with me that you like, right? And if you're sitting there trying to justify spending $5 for a piece of jewelry, I challenge you to go find a similar piece somewhere else for less. That is my challenge to you. I challenge you to go find a similar piece. Better yet, I challenge you to bring me your favorite piece of jewelry from wherever, and I will see if I can match it. Meaning, if I have something that is similar that doesn't cost an arm and a leg. So, I like challenges. Next up, this gorgeous bracelet. It is on a lobster claw. This is item number 647. So anytime the bracelets are on a lobster claw, they tend to have range, you know, you have a limited size with that because you've got the links on it. And they typically range from a six and a half to about an eight. I wear an eight, but I have to have it linked all the way out, right? I'm 5'9", I'm so I have my wrist a little bit. I'm big boned. I'm big boned, so I have to wear, you know, I have larger wrists and I have larger hands. So... But look at that frosted, and it is faceted, bracelet. This is so cute. This would pair well with a lot. We have, ooh, 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 ooh. I just thought, we have a white frosted necklace. Okay, y'all gonna see this again, because I'm gonna pair this with that white frosted necklace. So y'all can see how that pairs up. This is absolutely really cute. Item number 647. And I know I always say, ooh, this is cute. That's because, you know, sometimes y'all, when, at least for me, I'm, I can only speak for me. When I go through my inventory, when I first go through it and check it and everything, first of all, when I order it, I never know really what it's going to look like because, you know, things look different um, in person than they do on um, in a picture. And y'all know that's true because... I know some of y'all do that online dating and then you meet that person in real life and it's like, ooh, because they don't look like their picture. Well, our jewelry is like that, but in reverse, right? It looks nice in the picture, but you can't really tell how nice it looks. And then when you see it in person, you like, ooh, ooh, okay, I like that. Then you get mad because you wish you had ordered some more. So that's kind of what our jewelry is like. Because yes, everything, even pieces that I was like kind of questionable about, even, you know, the pieces that I'm questioning and that I'm like, well, I don't know how that's going to look. I'll just get a couple of those and then they come in. But even then, when I take inventory, yo, Lachelle, did I lie? Listen, 
where's the lie? Some people, look now, some people's pictures, they got so much makeup on and so many filters that when you see them in real life, you like, is that the same? You don't need, you can't even tell. I'm not telling the truth, shame the devil. Listen, next up. So like I said, our jewelry is like that, but in reverse. We see the picture, ooh, that's nice. Then it comes in, we take inventory. And even when we're doing inventory, it's like, oh, that's cute. But we don't really, at least for me, I don't, I don't really, I can't really tell how nice it is until I take it actually out and I like get it under some nice light or I put it on the bust or even I put it on and I'm like, oh, oh, well, shoot. Okay, this is, this is nice. So that's kind of how our jewelry is. And it's $5. Huh. Please and thank you. But look at this. I also have her in green and purple, I think. Green and purple. But the blue is new to the boutique, right? So she is gorgeous. Y'all know blue is one of my favorite colors. So she might make it to the personal stash. I'm just saying. Even though the baby daddy says I cannot get high on my supply. Mm -hmm. 644. I'm not getting high. I'm modeling. So this is item number 644. Here are the earrings to it. All right. Five dollars. And I see some of y'all floating around in the background. Y'all come on in. You know, I there's no pressure here. We like to have fun. Y'all come on in. I'm going to hit another trivia question. Now, the ringer, I think he's gone. But y'all come on in. You say, call it what you want. Girl, listen. Listen. You know good. Well, it's like them people that don't have their real name on their profiles. And you don't know if that's who Pookie. I don't know who Pookie is. I don't accept friend requests from Pookie. And then they have a picture and you, that ain't what they look like. You know, come on now. I, mm, come on now. False advertising. That's false advertising. Hey, Laverne. Lachelle just asked about you. What famous island prison is located in San Francisco Bay? What favorite famous island prison is located in the San Francisco Bay? I'm sorry, because the way it's written is not written grammatically correct, so I had to fix it. If I read it the way it's written... I'm going to read it the way it's written. What famous island prison is located San Francisco Bay? It threw me off. Very good, Lachelle. Yes, Alcatraz. Alcatraz. All right, next up, we're my acrylic lovers. Acrylic lovers right here. This piece is considered pink, but I see some swirls of purple in her. And I need to find some piece, pieces that I'm going to match her to. That right there. This is item number 646. It's got silver capping on it. Both of y'all got it right. Yes, yes, la yes, Laverne. I thought I saw Lachelle pop up first. I think I did not say Lachelle. So Lachelle, you get credit for that since I said that. Even though Laverne shows up first on here. But I think I said Lachelle. I could have sworn I saw Lachelle. So this cute acrylic bracelet look at that item number 646 absolutely gorgeous the acrylics you have to be careful oh you're fine you don't have to explain why you are late the shell just know you to quit the trivia queen that's why she was asking so listen with the acrylics you have to be very careful with those. You can kind of reshape it if you gently heat it with like an air dryer, like a, a blow dryer, but I wouldn't do it too hot, you know, too hot. So you have to be very gentle with these, but they can't, you know, it does have some flex. It does have some play in it, right? It does have some play in it. So that's item number 646. Hey, 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 y'all come on in. I see y'all in the background. Come on, come on now. Y'all come on in here. Come on in here. 
All right, next up. Mm. Next up. And y'all, my allergies are acting up because they since they were cutting like sawdust and stuff, so I got all that stuff in my head. Oh, my. Y'all, listen. She has been sitting downstairs. I don't know what happened, but you going to see her again. Y'all see these earrings and this iridescent or this, this oil slick? First and foremost, she will pair really nice. This is item number 651 with that chroma color bracelet, that multicolored bracelet that, um, that I have. Right? And you're going to see her again. I'm probably going to pull it out tomorrow because you're going to see all of it. This, look at her. Okay, you can't look, look. That is so pretty. Right? It's not gaudy, but the colors, you can wear virtually anything with this. And then pair it with that bracelet, that iridescent bracelet or that, that oil slick bracelet. This will also go with the oil slick Z collection necklace that we have and why can't I think of the name of it I can't think of the name of it right now but I will have her out tomorrow too so but I wanted to show you this item 651 absolutely gorgeous oh my goodness this is absolutely gorgeous 651 all right all right all right and I told y'all I don't have too much stuff tonight because my house is a wreck Laverne, did you ever, did you get all of your pieces? Has everything arrived? I think everything has arrived now. So next up, now that, our, now that the post office is returning to some form of, some semblance of normalcy. So I do appreciate your patience with everything. Next up, this gorgeous bracelet. Look at that beautiful blue. It looks like the Caribbean waters. This is item number 640. This, the name of this one, it has Stargazer in it. So this one is actually is going to make it to my personal collection, of course, because of the Stargazer Boutique. But look at this. This is so dainty, so pretty, absolutely gorgeous. Here are the matching earrings. Now, again, these are a little dainty. I would probably put those in my second hole, item number 640 for the necklace. It has a two-inch extender, so if you want it to be a little longer, you can. Right. If you're a little swole up in the neck area, you can, you know, make it a little two inch, two inches longer right there. OK. But absolutely, this piece is gorgeous. It, it has Stargazer in the name. I can't remember the exact name, but those the colors of that, that uh oh, that aqua blue. Absolutely stunning. Oh, that is stunning. All right, let's get another trivia question here. I don't like that one. Let's see. What winged Roman god is commonly associated with Valentine's Day? Winged Roman god. Let's see, let's see, let's see. All right, listen, I'm not done with the pearls. Y'all see this? Look at her, look at her. Yes, ma'am. It is Cupid. It is Cupid. Look at this piece. Listen, I think, do I have any more pearls up here? Oh my goodness. Look at this. She was downstairs. Hadn't been unpacked yet. Look, look at that spacer with the rhinestones in it. You've got three strands of pearls that are connected to this oversized rhinestone in the middle and then it's got the nerve to have the smaller rhinestones to bling it up even more look at her this is item number 648 i do believe this might be one of the bracelets that i'm wearing for the 20th right i do believe i do declare that she is going to be on my wrist yes sir and people are going to be asking me what you doing and they're going to say and i'm going to be like huh what huh Oh, 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 it's over there. You know, when they, when they ask me where something is, oh, it's over there. So I can make sure they see it. It's over there, right? This piece is gorgeous. Ooh, we, ooh, we. It is on the stretch band. Item number 648, 648. All right. Well, Laverne, you missed the first set of hoops. They were nice and large and in charge. But I saved some for you. 
These gold tone, this is item number 650. Those gold tone. So listen, I tried to tell y'all I didn't know what earrings I was going to put on tonight, right? Look, these are another pair. Y'all like to rock some hoops. Trying to tell you, y'all going to see these again. Item number six, I'm a sucker for a hoop. I'm a, Because look, right? Watch this. They different looks. They different looks. Gold, silver. This one's kind of hammered, right? This one's braided. Those are different looks. Look, okay, yes. Item number 650. So you can never have too many hoops. Never. Ever. Never ever. All right. Another question. Ooh. The, ooh, okay, this is geography. All right, now pay attention. This is a geography question. The ring of fire, a ring of heavy volcano and earthquake activity is located in what ocean? Right? The ring of fire is located in what ocean? There's five, so it should be easy. Next up. Look at this gorgeous leather snap bracelet. Yeah, I actually could have worn that with this shirt too, right? This shirt is kind of like my reggae vibe shirt. I absolutely love it. It is the Pacific Ocean. But this is just a basic leather strap and it's got a silver ring, but it does the job. You add an accessory, it changes the look. It's not too dressy. It's very casual. Item number 641 for her. I have it in the second snap. It has two. So I had it in the tighter snap, but you can loosen it up if you want. Hi, Shanetta. Welcome to the boutique. This is, again, item number 641. 641 for her. And then, look. Now, see, I must have been feeling orange tonight because I pulled out orange. And then I have the nerve to pull these out. 672. Now, Laverne, I know you were asking for some orange earrings. These just came in, so don't get mad. These are so cute. Look at this. I'm hoping that there's a necklace that comes out to match this. I do have a ring that would match this really well. This is item number 672. Absolutely gorgeous. This is on silver tone. This is another one I could get away with my reggae shirt, y'all. Right? Right here. That orange, that's so pretty. This can be tropical. It can be whatever, the fall. However, orange is one of those colors that it can you can wear at any season, in my opinion. But what do I know? Right? What do I know? All right. Another trivia question. Um, I don't like that question. Let's see, son. Let's see. I don't like that question either. Oh, I don't like that question either. Okay, let's see. Here we go. This is going to be too easy. Too easy. Watch this. Burgundy wine is a dark shade of what primary color? Burgundy wine is what primary shade is, is a dark shade of what primary color? That's too easy. That was too easy. All right. Next up, y'all look. <laughs> Hold up now. Wait a minute. Okay. Look at this. This is a wrap or coil bracelet. It is black. It is brown it has some flecks of gold in there but it is acrylic red is correct ding 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 this is item number 652 652 this is a wrap acrylic bracelet my god my god what you say my god <laughs> listen now this is another one that i would potentially stack. I would want some more. I would want a couple more on. 
But look, 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 look how cute. Look how cute this is. Yes. Absolutely adorable. And I would actually pair this with some brown. I have, not brown, with uh, some black, either the black leather feather earrings or the black wood earrings, I think would be really cute with this. Ooh, 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 because I don't think I have any acrylic, uh, black acrylic or tan acrylic. Not yet. It's coming. Not yet. But it's coming. Don't you, don't you fret. It's coming. But item number 652 for this one. 652 for her. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, y'all, I know, look, it's quiet tonight in the boutique. I think I might be coming on too late. I think my sweet spot is 830. I think my sweet spot is 830. So I might have to adjust my Friday night time. But that's all right, folks. will shop the replay. So look at it, look at it, look at it. Blue and orange. I must have been feeling that tonight. Blue and orange. And those colors actually go together. Look at this gorgeous piece right here. Look at that navy blue bead surrounded by those rhinestones on that delicate silver chain. This is item number 642. Here are the earrings to match. Now, you know, I'm that girl. So I'm going, I'm going to just bump the earrings up, right? Go ahead and upgrade those earrings. But look at this. Absolutely gorgeous. On that little delicate silver chain, it's on a two inch extender. So you can drop it down if you don't like where it hangs, you can drop it down a little bit lower. But that is such a simply elegant statement right there. So pretty, let me back it up so you can get a full view of it. But this is so pretty. Item number 642, 642 for her. Y'all, y'all gotta forgive me, my allergies are like, mm. All right, next up, next up. These are fun little twists. Item number 649, they've got a splash of color. You think just regular old silver disc, but just that little splash of color gives it a personality. That little red and Valentine's Day is coming. So are you prepared? Are you ready? Get your splash of red. Show some love. Be festive. I think we aren't festive enough anymore. You know, people don't, not that you have to really celebrate, but it's fun to like acknowledge. Like when we were in school, we wore the little Valentine shirts and the little, you know, you exchange. Not that you really got to go out. You don't have to go out and spend no insane amount of money or make things commercialized, but you can still be cute. Right there, $6.49 for those cute little earrings. That's what, and you get that little pop of color, right? So it's just a silver disc with a pop of color on it. Very cute. Let's see. Next up. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. That acrylic bracelet that I just showed will go with this necklace. Next up, this piece right here. I know. I think it's called Solar Beam. This is item number six thirty-eight. See them little, see them little teen earrings right there. Yeah, we're gonna have to do something about that. Those little earrings, who who they for? But they're free, they're free, right? So you just upgrade your earrings for five dollars, right there. That little solar beam, okay. But does this not go with that? I me thinks it does. I think you can get away with that. I think you can rock that. This is item number six thirty eight for the necklace. But this is actually really cute together because you've got that dark brown stone, almost looks like a, it's not cat's eye. It almost looks like a jasper, but you can get away with that. I like that. That's a $10 look, $6.38. Or, you know, do you, do you switch up them earrings, you change some, change your earrings, right? You can do that. You can do that because it's your business. What's that girl, what that woman say, Tabitha Brown? She said, that's your business. I say Bobby Brown, it's your prerogative. You do what you want to do. All right, next trivia question. A person that makes barrels for wine storage is known by what title? 
A person who makes the barrels for wine. What are they called? What's they called? What what they called? What's their name? That's gonna be the last trivia question because I got to go. My house is still a wreck. Next up, right here. These are fire. Yes, item 668. Yes, sir. These are saying something, right? All statement pieces don't have to have bling on them. Even though these do have like a bling factor, they're like, they're ridged. They are textured, but they are very smooth. And that ribbing is on both sides. This is item number 668. But these say something, right? Not everybody likes all that bling, the rhinestones. And the, I mean, I don't know who wouldn't, but not everybody, you know, not every look requires that. But these are something that you can wear and they're quite versatile. You can dress them up. You can make them casual. I really like these. I didn't think I was going to like them as much. I thought they were kind of basic. But I've, and I've said again, there is nothing basic about our jewelry. Absolutely nothing. I can find something to wear with everything that's it, that we have in inventory. I love that challenge. Right there. 668. And then, yo, I told y'all I was keeping it short tonight. Last but not least, these leather beauties that I have on right here. Oh, my goodness. They're so lightweight. They have silver hardware. They are, they are considered a brown leather, but they, are, they do have um, some texture to them. The back, you know, the back is smooth right here. But these things right here are so gorgeous so tropical and i'm telling you these are going to be a staple vacation earring so people going to see me in my pictures and they're going to be like why you got them earrings on again like because i can this is item number 645 for these earrings 645 for those earrings these y'all gonna see these a lot they're i don't know if they're considered orange or brown but they're both I would, I would classify them as both, right? Because the back of it is brown, the back of it. So I, I they're probably orange. You find what you want to wear with it, right? Brown or orange, but they are leather. They are extremely lightweight. Y'all see it's not tugging on my ear at all, right? I told y'all I don't wear nothing that's going to tug on my ear, 645. I'm not trying to have that old long droopy ear hole. I'm not, not we're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that. Pres preserve the ear hole. So listen, I want to say thank y'all. I told y'all I was gonna keep it short tonight. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I need to go take some allergy medicine. I appreciate y'all for coming in and stopping and shopping. If you do not see that red live, that means you are watching the replay, and replays are Okay, because people watch reruns on TV all the time. You can watch the replay. If you like something that you see, you just put the item number in the comments with a star next to it to let me know that you are interested in that item. You can also visit my website that is pinned at the bottom of the video, and it will also be in the comments. You will see that, and you can go and you can shop directly from my website as well if you want to see what else I have. Um, in the Stargazer Boutique. So I thank you all. Good night, good night, good night. Laverne, I know you're going to be, you're getting ready to travel. I'm not trying to put your business out there. So have a safe and wonderful trip and enjoy yourself if I don't talk to you before then. But again, thank y'all again for coming. Oh, look, listen, I told y'all things are wreck over here. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Y'all okay? Y'all, ooh, 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 ooh. Y'all okay? Okay, my bad. Again, I thank y'all. And look, see, they've been messing with that sawdust. Y'all see how I'm red? Because all that stuff that they've been working on the floors, I done broke out. Y'all see that? I got to go take something and put something on my face because I done broke out from the stuff where they were cutting the floors and everything. But anyway, I'm going to get out of here so y'all can go enjoy the rest of your Friday evening. If you're watching this on Saturday or Sunday, happy weekend. I hope you enjoy yourself. Again, you can shop 
that link right there at the bottom of the video. And y'all have the most wonderful weekend. And I will see y'all. I'll probably do some pop-ins this weekend I, 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 because I need to check on y'all. I need to make sure y'all okay. So I'm probably going to do a couple of pop-ins. So y'all stay tuned. I'll see you. Peace.